All right, today we're gonna to do a quick video on leadership versus management. Crucial topic for so many new leaders, new managers, you need to get a handle on this stuff. And I'm kind of responding to a video done by a friend of mine, Ian, at Grow Up Leadership. I'll put a link in the description. You should go check out his channel. It's packed full of really good stuff. But in that video, he was talking about the fact that organizations have to keep leadership and management in balance and the people doing leadership have to respect and value the people who do management and vice versa and you have to get that balance right across the organization and while i was watching it i was sitting there thinking but that's also true for you for individuals as individuals we have to get the balance right between leadership and management See, if you're watching this, you're probably in a leadership role of some kind or another, and chances are you've got to do management as part of that role. You might even have the word manager in your job title, on your email signature or your business card. So I'm not gonna tell you to be a leader and not be a manager. I want you to be a great manager, but I want you to make time to do leadership stuff as well. I want you to get the balance between leadership and management right because your company your organization will pour management stuff at you all day long okay your, your email inbox will be full of um, please fill in this spreadsheet please sign off these forms please make sure this has been done correctly your boss is going to check up on you about whether everything's been done it's been done right it's been done on time it's all management 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 stuff so to get the balance right, you have to find a way to make time to do the leadership stuff. So you've got to be really on top of your priorities. You've got to lean into the 80-20 rule. You've got to really understand the difference between urgent and important. You've got to have a really good system for managing the stuff that comes into your inbox. And you've got to have some kind of leadership impact project running alongside the daily grind of your management stuff, okay? You've got to find something to change that makes things better. You've got to find a new thing to do or a new way to do things that improves morale in your team or improves customer satisfaction, makes your underlying KPIs better. That's where you demonstrate leadership by changing things for the better. And I can show you exactly how to find and deliver a leadership impact project that can run alongside the daily grind of your management stuff. I show you in this quick Leadership Jet Start workshop. You can watch that at leadershipjetway.com slash jetstart. There's a link in the description. Click that, go watch that next, because it will show you how to get that balance between leadership and management right.